What's up, everybody? My name is Godzi, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Last episode, we made our way here to Cerulean City, where we decided to explore the northern routes and go and meet Bill at the end of Route 25. And then we went back to Cerulean City, where we complete, where we defeated Misty at her Pokemon Gym. And now we have two badges. Sweet. So I think our next order of business is making our way down here to Vermilion City. I'm pretty sure that's the third Gym Badge in Kanto. I could be wrong. Because <laughs> I know there's weird intricacies with how you're supposed to get around Kanto. Like... I don't know the exact route through it. Like, this is the most linear part of it. You go Pallet Town, Viridian City, Viridian Forest, Pewter City, Mount Moon, Cerulean City. It's all I fucking know. <laughs> I think Vermilion City is next. I'm just basing it off of what I remember from the anime. So, hooray. Oh yeah, that means Janine isn't the, uh... Food... Fuchisia City. Oh, it's not Fuchisia. Fuchsia? Fuchsia? F How do you pronounce that? Fuchsia? I think it's Fuchsia. I guess that means Janine's not the Fuchsia City gym leader, and it's probably Koga. I've never actually fought Koga as a gym leader, only as an Elite Four member. Oh, yeah, the Elite Four ain't gonna be what it was in Heart, Hol Heart Gold and Soul Silver either. That's something. Hmm. Well, I guess that means I'll. Well, what we have to do for now, at least, is. Enter this house where Officer Jenny was originally fucking guarding it until a Squirtle came up and stole her... Something, I don't know. Whatever. Aloha, people! V? Oh, wow. V? It's V. And the lady's just sitting at the table like, this is okay. Those are big footprints. V! Those are Psyduck footprints, right? V! V! Wow! You don't say! Oh well. Team Rocket must be trying to dig their way into something no good. My house was just fucking destroyed. Look at what Team Rocket have done to my house! And they stole my TM, the one that can teach Pokemon like Mankey and Sandshrew to move dig. Ooh, nice. I'm assuming I'm not going to have to give it back to you when I inevitably find it from the Team Rocket Grunt that's right outside your goddamn house. Are all my spices still here? They didn't take any of my spices. Fuck no, my oregano! <laughs> uh, Eevee, you made it sound like I could interact with that, but whatever. Let's just head out here and fight that fucking Team Rocket Grunt. I did heal up, right? <laughs> fucking dumbass over here. Yep. We're all healed up. Aloha. Hey, stay out. It's not your yard. Huh? Me? I'm an innocent, innocent bystander. Don't you believe me? Wait, what's this? Oh, no. Battle music. Now I'm obligated to fight you. Wow. Is that how you guys work? <laughs> you have... Oh, God. Eradicate. I didn't realize you would have one of those. What level is it? 15. That's an underleveled Raticate. Well, let's just do this. Holy shit. Yeah, this is gonna be helpful. Okay. Haha, <laughs> you can't move. Can I. If your. <laughs> if your Raticate's paralyzed, can I just go beat up the fucking grunt now? You're still a little girl, remember that. Eh. Where's the nearest rock? Uh, do I use Thundershock or Head. Well, Headbutt, I think, will do more damage even without. Uh, same type attack bonus. Oh, that's no fun. Owie. Okay, headbutt him again. Maybe he'll flinch. He didn't. In two turns of having paralysis and getting hit by headbutt, he nev he neither got per para paralyzed or fucking uh, flinched. So ain't that fun. Um... Yeah, I might as well. I mean, Bite doesn't do, like, any damage to Fairy-types anyways. I don't think. 
Eh. Yep, not very effective. You're still faster than me with paralysis, though. That's mm, very annoying. As long as I don't flinch. Okay. Kill it, my star thing. What are you? Ah, yes. Get fucked. Get fucked. Yeah. That was easy mode. Even though my Pikachu died. Oh, you go, Magikarp. Let's go, Eevee. Let's go, Nidorino. Stop. I give up. I'll leave quietly. 420. Annoying truck. Okay, I'll return to TM I stole. TM 10 dig. Nice. I better get moving. Bye. <clears throat> Alright. Let's talk to Mans over here then. Hello, Mans. Oh, you retrieved the TM? Thank you very much. You can keep that though. I've decided to take my time training Diggle and have them learn dig that way. <laughs> okay. Thanks. As if that wasn't a fucking obvious development. Alright. Let's fucking revive Pikachu. Alright. Aloha. Wrong continent. Oh, yeah, you're right. I mean, yeah, you're right. This ain't Aloha. It's Kanto. Okay. My Pokemon are all better. Adios, Mikan. Not my name. How do I even know her? We're from completely different games. Well, I guess we're both crazy, so we just kind of know each other on a spiritual level. That makes sense, wouldn't it, Eevee? Oh, yeah, you can't talk. Oops. Alrighty. So, now we head south. How do we get past Saffron? Do we just walk through Saffron City? And what's over here? Tree. And also, Route 9. Music changes for a second, then goes right back. <coughs> ah, finally, I can read- Finally, I can read the sign! If you press the B button when a Pokemon is in the middle of evolving, you can make it stop. Who genuinely does that, though, unless they're doing some challenge? Ah, hello there. Burn heal. Well, gonna need that for Cinnabar Island. Need some burn heal! Oh, there's the grass that I can't get to. This route's weird. I just ran down it in a straight line. Ether. Okay. What is this building? Hello? Oh, the daycare. Okay. I don't want to use that. Oh god, it's Yoshi Key. Man, where is she? Do 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 do. I'm on guard duty and I take my duty very seriously. But gee, am I ever thirsty? I wish I had some tea to drink. Uh, hold on there, kid. I'm afraid I can't let you pass through here. Ah, that's why. You're gonna stop us from going to Saffron City. So, uh, we're gonna have to go around the long way or something? Or, actually, no. This underground passage, right? Jigglypuff Fulpex? Man, there's a lot of good shit here. Will we? Run around the long way. Ah! I jumped right on the Pidgeotto's back. Hello there, big boy. Shit. What do, do I have raspberries? I sure do. What do Nana berries do? Fuck! I've been an excellent. If it just hit in the circle. Click! Hell yeah! Hi, catch rate my ass! Let's go, Bellsprout! Stun spore? Uh. What do you already have? Ah, yeah, I see. No. Uh, no. Keep old moves. 
Plus, Pikachu already has Thunder Wave. Awesome! Pidgeotto! This Pokemon is full of vitality. It constantly flies around its large territory in search of prey. Fucker reminds me of Kazami. Why does he remind me of Kazami? I never actually met him. <laughs> Bulpix! Hello! Hello, cute little thing. Fuck! What? Oh yeah, right on the noggin. This ain't gonna catch. Yep, knew it. Oh, come on. I mean, I guess I've never been very good in gym class. Hell yeah. That time it worked. Somehow. Am I just lucky? 60 EXP points. Yeah, catching Pokemon seems to increase your Pokemon's levels faster than actually battling, which is weird. Both its fur and its tails are beautiful. As it grows, the tails split and form more tails. Yo, dog, I heard you like tails. As if that's not a joke from, like, 2011. Jigglypuff! One of my favorite Smash characters, even if she's not good. <laughs> puff, puff! Get in the ball! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Why? Now that's what I'm talking about. Stay in the ball now! Yeah! <clears throat> you can tell it's early in the morning! <laughs> Okay, we got a Jigglypuff. That's awesome. Jigglypuff's one of my favorite Pokemons. Using its cute round eyes to enrapture its foe, it then sings a pleasing melody that lulls the foe to sleep. Yeah, sure it does. <laughs> then it gets the... Not, what, what would that be? It's early in the morning. It lines itself up just right, and then fucking destroys you. Any other weird-ass Pokemon on this route? Oh, wow. Just Pidgey- Yeah, just seems to be Pidgeotto, Vulpix, and Jigglypuff. Ah, shit. I jumped. Whatever. Hi, Yoshiki. Oh, hey, Ayumi. God damn it. Seems like we can't pass through the gate there. So I found this shady, dingy path. Oh, that's great. We're totally not gonna die in there. But the underground path should take us to Vermilion City. It's a bit dark and spooky, though. Huh? Hold still for one sec, Ayumi. No, please don't touch me. Stop! No! No! Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Why the hell did you kiss me? I didn't. W what, what are you on? Ah, oh, guess I'm just hallucinating. I was wondering what the sparkly thing was. This was stuck in your hair. How did that get there? What? Revives can heal Pokemon that have been knocked down battle. Yeah, I figured. I have a few extra, so here, take some of mine, too. Christ. <laughs> What's with the rival character just being like, Oh, I'm a weak fucking... Tiny, tiny obstacle that's in your way. Here's some revives. It's like, Yoshiki here is just how, basically. Maybe those will help you when you take on the next gym. Huh? Are those SS tickets you have? I've got one extra, so... No way, they're for the SSN, right? I hear it's a luxury cruise liner that traveled all over the world. Man, I'd love a chance to see what it's like on the inside, even just once. Fine, here you go, retard, but we're not going together. Hey, are you sure I can have this? You know I'm definitely going, right? Where'd you get this anyway? Uh, from the talking Nidorino. <laughs> you got it from that talking Pokemon? Uh, what? Oh, it was a person after all. Well, I guess that's good to hear. It's still confusing. 
Hey, uh, just, uh, f forget about that whole thing, okay? I think I'll press on ahead. See you there. Oh my god, the movement is so stiff. It's like, ha, ha, ha. Ha, ha. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's not any different from how we technically move in our respective games. Even though that's on a grid. When my Pokemon is on my shoulder, it will let me know with its tail when there is an item on the ground nearby. Eevee, you've done that once. Am I just bad at finding shit? Ooh, hello. Hello, sexy. Or a pal. That's not as good, since there's no random encounters. Alright. This is a long path. Is this the fucking bridge from Shadow of the Colossus? Allure. Okay. That's better. Now. Oh. Well, that was fun. Oh, wow. The lighting's not great in the underground path. People drop a lot of things down there, I hear. Yeah, I found two things. Christ. <laughs> That's better. What is up, Route 6? This is your host, I am Mishinozaki, coming at you live from I don't know where the fuck I am. As per usual, probably gonna die. Super Potion. Sweet. I'm impressed I haven't come across the wrong end yet. Wait, this is Pokemon. Eevee, aren't you my item finder? Well, I guess there ain't an item here. There was a Pokemon there. Double battle. Excuse me, this is a private conversation. Oh, great. You are trainers who will battle me. Picnic or Nancy? Still no Naomi. Neither and Fima at this point. Whatever. That's easy mode. You're fucking going down. Um. Yeah, just headbutt it. For black. Pikachu, you do like no damage. I'm probably gonna replace Pikachu for a ground type. Like, as soon as I can. Just because I already have, like... Electric beats, like, flying. Plus, I have Eevee with an Electric-type move anyway, so it's not like it matters. And this Pikachu just ain't good. I don't know why. But it does, like, no damage, and it takes a fuck ton. Is it even gonna beat this Nidoran? I mean, we're coming up on Diglett Cave, I think. Oh, fuck yeah. I do not have a uh, quick attack. That's fine. I'm still faster. Alright, good. Jigglypuff now, huh? Well, you'd be weak to poison. So, how comes... Bellsprout or Nidorino? Well, let's just send out Nidorino. He has Poison Sting. Not bad. I mean, it's not good either, but it's super effective. Alright, Nidorino. Uh, fucking murdering. Her, sorry. Wow, that does a lot more damage than I thought it would. <laughs> I wish we had fucking... What's that ability? Rough Skin. No, wait, Rough Skin... Is Rough Skin the ability that works kind of like thorns in Minecraft? I forgot. Bide! That's fun. Murder it! Okay. Now, just one more shoot, and you'll win. Now, shoot it in the face. Boom! Right between the eyes! Hell yeah! Now that's what I'm talking about, Clefairy. I might replace you eventually, too. Amnesia, huh? Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. I mean, I'm probably never gonna use Defense Curl. Right. 
I mean, Amnesia raises special defense. Huh. I'm probably never gonna use Sing, actually, because it's just so shit accuracy. Alright. We did it. Ugh, I hate losing! Thank you. Get fucked! Alright, let's switch around my party a little bit. Because this boy ain't having it. Who's there? Quit listening in on us. You're about to get fucked too, just like your girly friend over here. What's your stupid ass name? Ricky? Well, I guess Nidoran. Sandshrew. Oh. Well, that's fun. I just switched literally to my poison type. Granted, it was from my electric type. Hmm. Yeah, just slam bam. Slam bam, send it to the damn ham ham slam. Sham, fram, cram, clam. Get him. That did like no damage. It probably doesn't even have a ground type move at this point. It's probably, yeah, it has fucking poison sting. Weird that Sandshrew can learn poison sting, but all right. I always forget Sandshrew's a Gen 1 Pokemon. Same with Venonat and Tangela. Did you know Tangela's a Gen 1? Isn't that weird? Please at least kill it. Sweet. Alright, what's next on the agenda of things to murder? Nidoran. Oh, great. Uh, I don't have a Psychic type. I mean, I'm just the bigger boy version of him. Wish I had a ground type already. Oh yeah, plus there's a poison type gem. A, a ground type would be really nice to have. Let me show you how the big brother does it. Hell yeah! That was a crit. What's your damage, kid? Oh yeah, none. <laughs> you do no damage to me. You might have done one. Was that a second crit? Or just a high damage roll? Alright. I just can't win! Thank you, Ricky. Get fu- Ah! Ah! It's a lot of Pokemon. There's a Sailor. Vulpix, Jigglypuff. Ha ha! Ha ha ha! I'll battle you like a gentleman. Get back to the toilet, Shimoda. I'm considerably older than- Well, probably not, actually. He's a ghost, but still. Gentleman Edward. Hello! Hello, Ed boy! Oh, you have an Eevee. How interesting. Good thing I have this little funny thing called Double Kick. Okay, ow. Alright, murder the imposter! Crit! Damn it! Nidorino! Quick attack again? God, you're annoying! Kill it! Fuck yeah! Now I can get the item behind you. Hog! Super annoying and frustrating! They all have the same fucking... I lost expression! Just one hand near their fucking teeth. And the other, like, thrown behind them and a guard spec ain't worth. Pidgey... Pidgeotto, Vulpix, and Jigglypuff. That's the extent of Pokemon on this route. You're a sailor, so should I just... I'm gonna switch into Bellsprout. Because I get the feeling that you have water types. Ha ha! I've never seen you around. Are you good? You're about to see, old man. I'm not that old. I'm like 40. Sailor Elijah. Oh, actually, you're considerably younger than 40. I'm 25! <laughs> Tentacle. You're a Gen 1 also. I always forget that. And eh, I forget Tentacle's the one fucking water type that isn't really weak to grass. Alright. It still does a good amount of damage though, so I can't really complain. Can you leave my Bellsprout alone and just fucking perish? 
Hell yeah! R7. Alright, you're too good! Thanks, Elijah. I'm going back to Heartbeat's bar now. <laughs> Gonna fight some guy. I'm sure he'll fuck you up. Yeah, probably. <laughs> okay, thank you for leaving my fucking paralyzed heal alone. That might be good, actually. For the upcoming gym. There's still more trainers. Holy shit. Oh, what? Okay, I can just walk between you fucks. Me? Well, okay, I'll play. Is it because there aren't double battles in Gen 1? Can't have that fucking shit. Picnicker Isabel. Charmander? God damn it. Alright, whatever. Bell Sprout. Bo. Oh, Bo! Damn. This is gonna be an annoying. Did a good amount of damage, and you're not using a Fire-type move, so that's a good start. Get it, my flower boy! Oh, hell yeah! Grass-type just beats the Fire-type. Boom! Get fucked! Nice. Ooh, good job, Nidorino. Good job, Pikachu. Things just didn't work out. Thanks. I almost ran straight into that Vulpex. Huh? You wanna talk to me? Got some beef, kiddo? I'll slap you sideways and fuck you up at the same time. My name's Jeff. Oh, great. You're hilarious. Also, that's great, too. Who's this fucking glitch in the Matrix? Will my weakened, stronger one beat you? Or will your... Less weak... Or will your... Okay, no, you won't. You're really stupid! Quad resist! I mean, granted, yours wouldn't know headbutt. But at least acid is a good choice. Get fucked! Stupid idiot. Ooh, Magikarp's level 14. Get in there, dude. This stinks, I couldn't beat your challenge. Thanks for the great balls, kiddo. <laughs> I fucking figured. It's huge! Get away. I don't think there's any particularly interesting Pokemon on this route. On the road to Vermilion City, that's the... Uh... Where's the Pokemon Center? Old man, Machop. There it is. Damn, I got a heal. Alright. Half an hour and we were finally here. At least I'm faster than Ash Ketchum. He'd have an episode for each NPC on each route. And every NPC in each town. That's how they make the episodes. They just take every NPC in each city and it's just like, this is how long we're gonna stay here. An episode dedicated to this sailor, episode dedicated to this youngster, episode dedicated to this fisherman and that hiker, as well as the nurse and herself, and one more for her chancy. So, six episodes for Vermilion City. Oh, but you can't forget about him, her, him, this house. Okay. I should head over to Diglett Cave. Vermilion City, the port of exquisite sunsets. Alright, let's let's find the gym though. Fire oh there it is. Oh. Hello? Yo, champ in the making. Beyond this point is a Vermilion City gym. But you need to chop that tree down first. Do you know how to chop a tree? Hmm, well as I recall, the captain of the SSN was an expert at chopping trees. Well that's obnoxious! Okay, let's head over to Diglett Cave. Fuck yeah. Oh, I can actually explore this route too. Super Potion! Super Potion Powers! That's a Pidgeotto- Oh, oh no! Aha! 
Whoa, <laughs> I've never lost. Streak's about to end, buddy. Get fucked, Dirk. <laughs> Say we're Dirk. Po Poliwag's a Gen 1 also, that's right. Jesus. There's so many Pokemon I forget it are Gen 1. Scyther. <laughs> Jinx. Damn, even fucking Gothita. No, not that one. <laughs> Alright. Wait, you're level 18. Damn, this is gonna be good experience. Get fucked. Hell yeah. I, I would love for my Bellsprout to level up, you know? I ain't... Pff, not level up. Fucking... Machop. Yeah, I'll switch. I got Buddy Boy here with a flying type move. And I meant evolve. Not just level up. I don't know what level Bellsprout evolves into Weeping Bell. I think it's 20. Maybe 22. Okay. Wonder what I'm gonna do to you. Pack. That still doesn't do much damage. But that does even less. So it's not really an issue. Wonder if Headbutt will just do more. Because it's just a stronger move overall. Yeah. And you flinched. Get fucked. Alright. No damage. Well, like, five. And kill it. Ooh, kill him. Haha. <laughs> Sailor had a fighting type. Didn't expect that. My first loss. Thanks. Nope, Bellsprout does not evolve at 19. Pidgey, that's a worker. Another Pidgey. Allure, not bad. Ooh, hello! I forget your Gen 1 also, Mr. Drowsy. Bah! Really? Biggie! Oh my- Ow! Biggie! What? Nice! Get in the ball! Stay in the ball! <clears throat> Drowsy! Nice! We get out this time. Then I swear to god. Hell yeah! It's getting hot in here. Open up that window. Smash open the wall. With a rock. Level 20. You go, Eevee. <laughs> Let's go, Eevee. If you sweep by it all the time, it will sometimes show you dreams that it had eaten in the past. Ah. Fucking dream eater over here. <laughs> Oh, shit, I just realized, in a game setting like this, you know who might be easy to find? Fucking Karma. Oh no, Rapid Dash is a Gen 1. And clearly so is Pidgey. Holy shit, there's just nothing but Pidgeys. Super Repel. That last is blocking the path. Yep, she sure is. Slow walk! I've raised my Pokemon carefully. They should be ready by now. God damn it, kiddo! I'm trying to explore this universe! Last Tomoe. Well, that confirms they have some Japanese names in here. So now we'll just where's Naomi. Also, that's a fairy type. Meaning get fucked. Oh, wow. Not bad. Not bad at all. Just do it again now. If you also have a Clefairy, I'm gonna do a backflip. Except I don't know how to, so I'll break my neck. Was that neat arena? Well, that's annoying. What should I use against a neat arena? Um... <laughs> you know what? Fuck it. 
Eevee, I haven't really used you in a short while. Let's just use you. Let's go, Eevee! Alright, need arena. Um, yeah, just headbutt. And I forgot I have a dark type move on Eevee. Alright, there. Easy mode. Good thing you flinched, you stupid idiot. Also, why are you standing on your hind legs, but Nidorino can't? Gender equality, come on. <laughs> Clefairy level 17, yes. Bye-bye, thank you, and goodbye. Wow, what a cunt. You're lucky your name's not Naomi, or else I take the, that rock up to- Why?! <laughs> Of all things, I did not want to see this thing today. Oh, Christ, you're a tough boy. What's a Nana Berry do? Sure. Ah, I see, now he's gonna move around less. Yeah, I'm gonna need to use Great Balls. Four! This ain't gonna work. It worked! Holy shit! Still not using you on the team, because even if you're a weird-ass Pokemon, I'm not- You're not good. No one leveled up from that. That's 250 XP. The fuck? Come on, guys! You're also a fairy type? I did not know that. Always practicing its pantomime act. It makes enemies believe something exists that really doesn't. Okay. Who the fuck came up? There's another! Mime! Mime! Rah! Ah! Rah! Five great balls. Nice. I just used like three on that Mr. Mime, so... Certainly don't mind that. Certainly don't mime that. <laughs> There's a lot of rare Pokemon here. And by that I mean Drowsy and Mr. Mime. I can go this way. How far away can I go? Whoa, this route! Oh, that's where the fucker is. I knew there was a Snorlax eventually, but hey, you're what's walking my path. Alright, let's go to Diglett Cave, see if we can find a Diglett, or better yet, a Dugtrio. What's up here? What? There's a second floor, god damn. I didn't realize I could go up another floor. Alright, but let's just cautiously make our way back through here. Holy shit! Radicate! The big jump for the big fuck. Why? Alright, work. Please, you're just a yellow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got a big rat. Still need to collect more bugs to throw them all at Naomi. Oh god, more than half of my team just leveled up. Bell Sprout. Need a Reno. Magikarp. Oh, you finally learned Tackle, right? Yeah! Yes! And Pikachu, who's gonna be leaving the team. At least temporarily. It's hind feet are webbed. They act as flippers so it can swim in rivers and hunt for prey. Nice. And Bellsprout did not evolve. Ha <laughs> ha! Scary Fox. God, like, every goddamn Pokemon in the world just spawned here. But on the other side of the route, there were none. Alright, let's go Diglett Cave. Hello? Well, I'll be! Did you know this huge long tunnel was dug entirely by Diglett? Okay. 
Probably why it's Diglett Cave. Diglett Tunnel. Hello? This path is closed because Diglett dug too many holes. We're filling the holes. Why don't you challenge the Vermilion City Gym? If Diglett's will appear... Yeah! Diglett, Diglett, wow, I'm doing it, I'm Wow, you're in easy mode, aren't you? You're a tiny boy. Hell yeah. Fuck yes! Now that boy is going on my team. Gonna have to train him up before tackling the gym, though, or the SSN. 79 e experience. E experience points, that's what I meant to say, yep. It prefers dark places. It spends most of its time underground, though it may pop up in caves. Sweet. Alright, now let's dick around see if I can find a Doug Trio. Zubat, that's not at all what I wanted to find. Diglett. No Doug Trio? I know for a fact you can find Doug Trios here. Ah, not another! Hello, Diglett. Go away. That's unfair, that Zubat went all the way over there. I mean, I wouldn't want to get him anyways, because I already have a Zubat. If it's just another Diglett or Zubat, the next Pokemon that shows up, yeah. Let's just add Diglett to my party then. And that'll be the end of that. Add to party, replace that Pikachu. What the? Oh, there's people biking outside, and one of them had a weird-sounding bike. That's something. All right, we got a Diglett. Diglett, 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 Diglett. All right, let's just fight the trainers on this route now. Start with Young Young Boy Boy. Hello, Young Young Boy Boy. Let's go, but don't cheat. I can't guarantee that, kiddo. Youngster Eddie. Hello, Ed boy. Need a Reno. Not a bad choice, kid. Especially since I also have one. This might be a tough fight for Bellsprout. But I don't care. Headbutt him. Quonk. Oh, yeah. Ooh, and you flinch, you stupid shit. Hell, yeah. Get him. Hell yeah. Oh no. Okay, we're good. Murder him. Clonk. Right on your stupid skull. Now that's what I'm talking about. Huh? That's not right. <laughs> yeah, it is, kid. What do you think is right, then? How about... Wait. Is that a Pidgeotto or a Pidgeot? It's Pidgeotto. It's cry sound or like Pidgeots. That's a drowsy. Man with the plan. What? I'm looking around. Oh my god, I'm invisible. I have never won before. You're probably going to be tougher than that sailor down there, then. Gentleman Wilco. Vulpix. Oh, well, you already have a leg up on me. I just have a bell sprout. Well, I don't have just a bell sprout. But I don't have anything... Well, I do have Diglett. Does Diglett have any ground-type moves, though? I should check. Oh, that's annoying. Hmm. Oh boy. Hit him. Hell yeah! That's a good flower. That's what I'm talking about. 
We're level 21. Great, EBS. If you need that. Swift. I mean, that's better than Quick Attack, but... Oh, no, no, no. It, it's not that it always goes first. It's that it always hits. Yeah, I don't need a... Clefairy, my boy. Girl, metronome. Sure, just for fun, at least. At least now you have a better attacking move. What am I never gonna use? Defense curl. Alright. That's what I'm talking about. I saw this coming! Nice. Alright, let's put Clefairy in the front to see uh, what metronome gives us. Because that'd be fun. Alright. Ah! That, no. No. Bad. Pidgey. Go away. Stupid piece of shit. I fucking hate you, you stupid piece of shit. There's another Pidgey out now. Hello. Hello. Do you use electricity safely at home? What, what trainer class are you? A worker? Carpenter? Engineer? Braxton. Oh, Voltorb. Hello there. I haven't run into one of you yet. Alright, Clefairy. Let's do it! Um, yeah. Let's just try Metro now. Light screen. Well, that's annoying. Ah, ha, ha. Do it. Use a really cool move. Super Fang. Well, that would have been nice. Okay, here comes Swift. What you gonna use this time, Clefairy? Conversion. Change type to normal. Wow, okay. Well, that's... Uh, now we've just gone back in time. Flamethrower! Neato! They don't really do much damage, but still. Having fun so far. Do it! Haze. Okay. All stat changes were eliminated. Great. Oh, Sonic Boom. That ain't fun. Metronome. <laughs> Recover. No, Explosion! Crab hammer! Kablonk. Um, if you use Sonic Boom, I'm dead. Thundershock. I might not be dead. Oh! Explosion! Sc screech! God damn it! No, what I wanted! The fuck? No, 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 no. Use it! Super Potion. When did they buff Super Potions? Used to be only 50 HP, now it's 60. Oh, great. Sonic Boom. Metronome. Oh, great. Here comes Light Screen again. Now kill it. Ooh, Hydro Pump. Boom. Ah! How do you survive that? That's some strong ass water. Alright. Barrier. Okay. Having fun with Metronome here. Kill it. Use a really good move. Haze again? Well, there goes my stat change that I just worked so hard for. The last Metrodome, please be something good. Come on. Poison powder. Actually, this might kill him. It killed him. <laughs> Good job, Clefairy. God, that was weird. You're great! You beat me! 
Did I though? Does that really count? I don't think that counts. Alright. Let's send you back in. Well, let's actually take a look at you. What moves do you have? Uh, you don't have a ground type move. I'd like for you to learn one. Really? Hey, do you always turn off lights? No, I don't actually. Engineer Bernie. Okay. Oh boy, Magnemite. You're Gen 1. <laughs> I always forget that. So you're a fucking obnoxious ass steel electric type. So you're gonna take no damage from anything, aren't you? Yep, about what I expected. And supersonic. Great. Yep, I'm switching. But into who? Eevee has... Actually, no, Nidorino has double kick. Sure does. Alright, yep, enough of that shit. Here comes Swamp. Thundershock. Okay, um, yeah, double kick. Kill it. That still does no damage. Was that second one a crit? Oh, great. Thunder Wave. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Goddamn paralysis on my Nidorino. And you have another Pokemon after this. What fun. Kill it. Clonk. Hell yeah. What's next? Voltorb. Okay. Kill him, Eevee. Get him, Eevester. If for no other reason than because you're good. Alright. Um, yeah. Just kill it. That's what I'm talking about. Swift? Okay. Seriously doesn't matter, though. Bite him. Chomp. And there goes your Pokeball. How sad. Whoa, kids nowadays are so strong! That's a very disturbing facial expression. There are still some more trainers. We got that boy. That sailor. Just the, just the two, then. Win, lose, or draw! How do you get a draw in a Pokemon battle? Get Gamer Hugo! Gamers, rise up! Diglett, huh? Well, I got Bellsprout. And Bellsprout has a few words for you. Actually, two of them. What? That's a level 26! Ah! Oh, no! <laughs> Didn't expect that! God damn it! Now what do I do? Fuck! Ah. Uh, well, Fisher rarely actually hits, so... That's, I was not expecting a level 26 Diglett. The fuck, man? Okay, thank God. There we go. If you kill Eevee with fucking Fissure. Okay, good. So that's your game. Gamer. You sure are a gamer if you have a level 26 Diglett. Didn't go my way. Even if all five of your fissures hit, dude, I have six Pokemon. So, shit was screwed for you from the beginning. I'm the strongest among my friends. I have no friends. Yep, didn't think so. Sailor Yasu. Okay. Slowpoke. Alright. That's, uh, just... Is it water psychic, or is it just water? 
Or is it just Psychic? I always forget. Well, either way, Headbutt. And I'm still faster! You're beefy! Ah! Well, goodbye, Nidorino! Yeah, I'm gonna need to go heal up after this fight. Holy shit. Eevee! Let's go! Why? Um, yeah, Buzzy Buzz. Big Zap! Now that's what I'm talking about. Poke. Oh wait, I got the TM for Dig. I could probably give that to somebody. Ha, ah, my Pokemon need to be stronger! Yeah, sure. Alright, got every trainer on this route defeated. And basically caught every variation of Pokemon on this route. Oh, we still have the coach. Shit. Well, I should heal up anyways. Then we still have the SSN to do. But I think I'll just do that next episode. Alright. Yeah. Let's do this. Heal up my mons. Thank you, Mikan. Still not my name. I don't care. Alright, let's check out the TMs that we have. Oh boy, we got a fucking few. Um, Eevee can learn Payday. Nobody can- Actually, no, Kaferi can learn Thunder Wave. No one can learn Seismic Toss. No one can learn Scald. Few of us can learn Dig. I'm actually gonna give that to Nidorino. Not gonna give it to Eevee. What's useless here? Double Kick? I guess. Since quite a few of my Pokemon know Double Kick. And then I should also give it to Diglett, just cause he is a ground type after all. And that'll make the gym considerably easier. Alright. Um, what am I not going to use? That's right. Gravel. <laughs> Alright. Neat. Not bad. I hope I find a Moonstone eventually, so that when Nidorino gets to a reasonable level, I can evolve him into Nidoking. That'd be very, very nice. Alright. Let's go beat up that coach trainer. Now that we're a reasonable level, at full HP. Don't you like Route 11? The double ones in its name are so cool. And guess what? I'm the coach trainer on Route Double One. I'm a coach trainer. Think you can take me on? Yeah. I won't hold back. Yeah! You're an odd one. Don't make fun of me. Coach trainer will, okay? Ratata. Really? Or is, uh, let me guess, it has some stupid, like, Endeavor thing. It's gonna use Endeavor, ain't it? Oh, Super Fang, that's great. Yep, that halves my HP. You have a lot of defense! Crunch. Alright. What is with this fucker? Oh, great. Quick attack. Don't kill. Damn it! Well, guess who I'm fucking using, then, if you're so beefy? I'm using Eevee! Fight! Fucker probably has an assault vest on or some shit. Something that stupid raises its defense. Alright, Super Fang. Still did that much damage. Holy shit. Double kick. Crunch. Still faster than you, idiot. Alright, there we go. 
Yeah, that was a chore. You had some sort of gimmick, for sure. You're strong. Am I? You're strong! You've got me in a good mood, so take these! Five Eevee candies? What the fuck are those? If you use an Eevee candy, Eevee will get much stronger. If you want to get candy for a specific Pokemon, try catching that species over and over, or send them to the professor. So what, there's one for every type of Pokemon? The hell does it actually do? I assume it's in the candy jar. I see. Well, yeah, no point in just not using it. Makes him considerably better. Fuck yeah. Damn, they're really just trying to make your starter Pokemon, like, fucking stupid beefed up. Has my Eevee ever even died? I don't think he has. Hmm. Well, let's heal up again. So we still have the SSN, and then we have the Vermilion Gem. Not sure why I couldn't just jump over that tree. Or why one of my Pokemon, like, need a Reno, couldn't just fucking destroy it. I mean, I have two Pokemon that know Dig. They can just fucking uproot it. But, whatever. Alright, so I think that's gonna be where I'm ending today's episode. So, we still have the SSN, and we have the Vermilion Gym, and then after that, I think we're supposed to add the Celadon. So, that's fun. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. If you liked it, be sure to press the like button, and if you didn't like it, then fuck you too. Remember to subscribe, follow me on Twitter, and hit that notification bell to stay up to date on all my videos and stuff. And as always, my name is Godzi, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye!